guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting really to episodes 9 and 10 of The Blue Lock. Yes, you're probably wondering why the heck um, this didn't come out last week. Of course, I was very busy with a lot of things with work and a couple other things that I had to do while I was at home. Um, so I did not, unfortunately, have time to film this. So I was like, okay, I'm going to postpone it. I just forgot to tell you guys. Busy girl, busy life, and just great. So, coming out this week. But other than that, let's go ahead and get started with episode 9 in 3, 2, 1, go. <clears throat> let's see, of course, if Isa <laughs> Isagi employees win this, which is obvious going to happen. I literally forgot all about Nagi for a moment. I was like, yeah, they got this! And then, yeah, we see Nagi for like, shit. Excuse me. But once again, that's next level shit right there, my boy. Look at him. He just looks so cute. He's so precious. You can't think that someone so precious like that could do a kick like that. But no, he did that shit. Baby boy did that shit. And just once again, Isaki, how the fuck is this gonna go for your babe? Like, oh. Ugh. I'm already stressed. Did I update on my Mal for this? Or not my not my my other Mal account. I gotta do so many updatings on my first Mal. No, I did not. This episode nine, so I can yeah, I can kind of put it up until I, and then when I watch episode 10, I can update it. To update. Ew. Okay, everything is great in the world again. is like whatever happens after this like certain guys and certain teams still remain like in a group so like Isagi, Chikiti, um Bachida, the guy who looks like Ichigo they stay together as much as I want this whole group to stay together I don't think it's gonna happen that ain't pure luck that's a skill my boy Sorry about that. She was slow. Y'all say that. It's so cute. Uh.
this fucker just matched that same damn speed even more as chiggity? Oh, hell nah. Uh-uh. No! <laughs> That's done. That's three. Three. And this fucker. <laughs> Fuck him. I still hate him. Oh, no, 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 you'll see. You'll catch up. Don't just stand there. No, nope, you're gonna go the other way. No, nope, you switch him. Okay, one more. Nagi. Okay, well, three more. Banagi! Once again, Bacha just gives me Komaida feels. Like, I, I don't know why. No, no, I know why. I know exactly why. You'd be like, oh, he's cute little thing and then you really get to know him. Come on now. <laughs> it's over. Huh. That's one bitch. Let's go. If that did not lit a fire up your ass, I don't know what to do with you.
exactly. Because this game is not like <clears throat> every other match you've done before. This is, well, every single one has been a life or death situation. But this? <laughs> completely different. No. That just tells you in six months and whatever you're doing, you could become an absolute badass with it if you really hone your skills on that. I mean, we all know that's a damn lie. Hello, Ren from Free. Shit. That's why it's not gonna be him. So she pass behind you, right there, right there, pass it. Oh. That just fucking happened. Oh my god.
Of course. Nice. You fucking bitch. Oh my god, I'm getting... The fact that that's also Haru from Free, I can't... Once again, I can't... <laughs> Then get to it. Yeah, like a Super Saiyan, or just really evolving from the next form that you really have. Mm. Okay. And then in a way, it's almost like truly accepting it, too. Mm-hmm. You always hesitated. And in any type of sport, you can never hesitate.
No, what could because mm-hmm. I oh, don't know. Just, just watch. No, he mm -mm. but that freaking her. God. You would end right there. You would end right there. That's okay. That's four. That is four. Even though they didn't mark it, that is four. Four. I'm gonna skip the ending and I, I just wanna go to the next episode. That's it, okay? This is tense. I mean, truly to like be on hiatus with this show for almost like what, two weeks I believe, and then to come back into tenseness and stressful and hey, we only have this m amount of time before our careers possibly end and we all go home crying. Oh God. Jesus Christ. Oh my God. But like, I, I do like the fact is that everybody, first with Bachita, Bachita is just like, okay, let's just try something different. You know, when you have your, your one thing that makes you you, but you're still inspired by so many other players and matches that you've done, and you're finding that new formula and you're awakening to something else, usually... 100% that is going to light a fire in somebody else's butt and be like, okay, if he or she can do that, I can do that too. So truly in that moment, everybody was really inspired by each and everything that everybody was doing and being like, we, we can fucking get this shit. Like, ah. <laughs> Impressions. <laughs> On. <laughs> oh, come on, Chicken, just try. <laughs> that really just fucking happened. Oh my god. I mean, but yes. <laughs> like, I know, but you know, hey, gotta pay all this to his Seiyu because his Seiyu wants to give me get that guy. Like, because that's a man. Oh my god. Seriously. But I mean, because, like, probably this character would be maybe the creepiest character that his Seiyu has played. I know. But. Of course, I do have my favorites. Of course, Levi, Agaragi, um, a couple of others that I instantly cannot think about right now. But like, oof. But yes, like seriously, going back into this tension, words, words, <laughs> more tension, stressfulness, arguing, and such. It's a lot going on, and when you only have like that much bit of time left, it seems like. It seems like it's this, but it is actually this. And everything is starting on these last final moments for these guys on opposite ends. Like, you're, yes, you're going to do everything in your power. Ooh, shoot, excuse me. To 
be the ones to have the victory. I mean, because yes, at the end of the day, when I when I watch the first two episodes and then rewatch the first two, you know, I'm I'm the one who is like, I don't want anybody to lose. I don't want anybody to you know have their careers ending super short over this. But at the same time, I am one of those where it's like, yes, you guys can kind of fight to the death with this. I'm okay with this. Are we really going to hurt each other's feelings over this? Yes. Yes, we are. As someone who really likes to see chaos in her animes and sometimes maybe even some of my live action shows, not all of them, um, it, it's good. When it when it goes there, it gets really good. It's very much how I said in like the first two episodes. Um, what, how I thought of it when I watched it on my own first, where I was like, okay, I'm kind of getting like Danganronpa-esque. Where, but I thought it was like, when I, when, I think when they were talking about, and this is maybe who, whoever translated it, so it has to be between Crunchyroll and, and somebody else. There was a point where one of them said in the line, it was like executions. And that made me instantly think, okay, Danganronpa sports style and such. Um, you're, it kind of still gives me those feels and stuff, but you know, instead of them, you know, <laughs> that they're still alive. It's just their career is dead. And yeah, you know, at the same time where I'm like, yes, you know, I'm so sorry that you lost. But at the same time, I'm like, yes, you lost. Like, <laughs> but uh, it's just, mm -hmm. <laughs> but I'm hoping that in this next episode, everything truly goes well, that Isagi and his team are able to win whatever the heck is going to happen after this makes me also like, from what I remember, in a random TikTok that I saw. Like, Nagi's still gonna be there. That's the one thing that I know. Um, I don't know how. So, of course, either this is going to end with Team Z winning, or it's going to be a straight-up draw. Draw. Jaw. <laughs> draw. It sounds like I said, I'm saying jaw, but it's draw. Um, but, of course, we're not gonna know. Tensions are high as a mother effort, but go ahead and pause the video and I will see you guys in one second for episode 10. All right, episode 10 in three, two, one, go. <laughs> Oh, so it wasn't four, it's just three. Okay, never mind. I, I made a, a mistake. Your girly miscounted. But then the top comment. Your girl miscounted. <laughs> Got so excited. <laughs> tells me okay in that moment with Kwan and how he's like okay with 10 freaking members y'all are still doing this and y'all are thriving and catching up like I kind of regret what I did but still at the same time I I don't want anybody to be like guys you know what maybe we should all you know feel bad and have Kwan join back no he you know he dug up, he dug his own grave. Let him lie in it. That's all I gotta say. I understand his reasons on why he did it, especially when we got that little backstory on it, which I felt like, to me, there should have been a bigger episode for it. Um, But I get it, you know, when you're scars for time, you can't really do every single little thing. Duh. But still, it would have been nice. I felt like right now, we only see just the one-sided of him and I feel like there's more of him maybe we'll get to see that but I feel like after this like he's instantly gonna be dropped out and <laughs> we ain't seeing his eyes again <laughs>
But they like him now. Like, uh, itch. Traitor. Like, seriously, shut up for five minutes. The JoJo feels I'm kind of getting here, bro. <laughs> I mean, seriously, <laughs> you aren't going to avoid him. He's always going to be beside you. You poor thing, you hesitate and you are so locked up. That, that, ooh, I cannot speak. And the sad thing is he hasn't experienced that yet. Yeah, because they're boyfriends. Keep fucking going for it. Go on. Shut the fuck up. I swear to God. Because your boyfriend doesn't want to see you sad, babe. That's why. Yes, you don't want to see your boyfriend cry. Obviously. It's so obvious. But he's still gonna try. That's four. That is four. Ugh. He's talking. Oh my god. <laughs> Damn right, you. <laughs> Oh, 
13 minutes. I'm scared. <laughs> I mean, in the previous episode, your girl was fired up. I am terrified. Damn it, Nagi. 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 Nagi, Nagi, Nagi. Are you serious? Get out of the way! There we go! Bob! I want to, I want to scream. I want to scream so bad, but I can't. Oh, this. Oh. Asshole. That's four, 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 four. That's your awakening. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but come on, come on, come on, come on. If you, if there's one thing that you could tell that Kuan, if anything, you'd be like, oh, baby. You don't even know. They're not as serious as you. No. Yeah. 
For Kulan, it's not. For the rest of you, yeah, that's fine. But for him, no. Hmm. But go on. You always need friends. And if you didn't go into that like this, then you still would have been a part of the team. I get it. Hurt people hurt people at the end of the day. Hurt equals hurt, and that's how Kulan feels right now. He was hurt by his former teammates, and he's like, fuck it, I'm going to hurt my current teammates. But I feel like, babe, it's not going to end well for you. Please do not get this. Zagi, somebody make it to him. There you go. There you go. Where is it going now? Oh, oh God. I can't look. Hey, hey, nobody knew what the freak Kuan was going to do. So do not blame them for the itch that he just did. He did that all on his own. Yes.
Even though you were being an ass before? We had three minutes. It's not. Nice. Shit, Nagi. Nagi, no! Soggy, please, please. Damn it. Oh, no, 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 that's so mean. <laughs> you wanna wait till next Friday. Oh my God, no, you can't do that. That's bullshit. No, 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 no. No, I'm not waiting till next Friday. I can't wait till next Friday. That's too long of a wait next week. I might be stupid. I might do something stupid after this. I might watch the next two episodes. You, you cannot end a cliffhanger on that and expect me to wait until next week to watch it. I can't. No. That is some bull shit. Truly. Okay, Kuan. I do like it's funny how in the in this episode at the beginning I, I spoke on, oh, I kinda wish maybe hopefully we'll get that. Like it could be a bigger backstory, and then boom, we get that in this episode. It didn't really feel it felt as big as I thought it was. It was more like a medium notch S, but it was interesting to see how he was when his uh the soccer club for his school started and then how he is now and how he thinks and stuff. Because of course, yes, I think if the Kuan now would have talked to the Kuan, you know, beforehand, yeah, maybe something could have been different me.
<laughs> That's adorable. But if it's still, like, mm, I, I was genuinely not expecting Kuan to do what he did. Because, like I said, you know, when we, in the first couple episodes, when you see Kuan, like, yeah, he's like precious big boy. He, boy, he gives me, like, kind of Brock Pokemon vibes. Um, more, like, a mixture of Brock from the anime versus Brock from the games and such. Um, and then when you, like, I would say the Brock from the game is when, like, he, his true personality pops up and such. But I, I love the fact that, you know, he, he wants to see his team, even though he's not a part of the team anymore, though, but at the same time he is, wants to see them thrive. Yes, they're going against, like, the baddest team, the most powerful team in Blue Lock as of right now, but I have hope. I have major hope that they will survive this. Truly. I, I hope. Please. Cause I, I might, like I said, I might end up being stupid and I might end up watching this next episode, these next two, because like I said, I can't wait a whole week. I gotta know. I gotta see how this outcome is gonna go. Because ending on that with Isagi with the ball and then Cliffhanger, that's good. But as someone who hates Cliffhangers, not bad. No. No, no, no. No, no, no. No, 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 no. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episodes 9 and 10 of Blue Lock. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next week. <laughs> I'm about to say Saturday. Next Friday for episodes 11 and 12. Until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.